In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the Epic Games Error IS0003 installed failed, could not create directory. This is actually a relatively simple one to fix, so let's just jump straight into it. First thing you want to do is come to your start menu and search for run, and then we can just hit enter. Inside of here, you want to type in percentage sign, local app data, and percentage sign, and again hit enter. Scroll down until we find the Epic Games Launcher folder, inside of saved, and in here you should see a folder called web cache, and you just want to right click on this and select the trash icon. If you are unable to delete this folder, it's because the client is actually running in the background, so you'll just need to come to the task manager by pressing Control alt delete on your keyboard, and at the top here, you just want to search for Epic Games. And then if you do see anything running in here, you just want to right click it and end the process to close that down. And then we can come back and try deleting the folder again. You can now check to see if that works. Otherwise, the next thing we're going to do is make sure we're running the app as administrator, as well as disabling full screen optimizations. So to do this, head to your desktop and you want to locate the Epic Games launcher and right click this and come into properties. Inside of the compatibility tab, make sure you have disable full screen optimizations checked and also run this program as administrator checked and then you can press apply and OK to save the changes. Once again, we can check to see if that gets rid of the error, otherwise move on to the next method. So lastly, if you're still getting the error message, the last and final thing we can do is completely uninstall the app and then reinstall it with a clean version. We can do this by heading to the start menu and searching for run and hitting enter. And inside of here, you just want to type in appwiz.cpl and then hit enter. From this list of applications, we just want to select Epic Games Launcher and hit uninstall. And then once the app's uninstalled, you can head over to the Epic Games website to re-download it. Now, hopefully by following these steps, that's resolved the error message. But if you still are experiencing problems, please drop a comment below and I'll try my best to assist you. If this video did help you, please drop a like and subscribe. Until next time.